wish I'd never met Victor Burke. I was willing to forget about the whole video poker scam, but Gavin just wouldn't let it go. When Victor couldn't pay us back, Gavin came up with a different form of repayment. What did you ask Victor to do? Gavin said we were just gonna smack him around a little, straighten him out. Next thing I know, Gavin's got him hanging over the balcony. I tried pulling him back up, but Gavin was pissed. Victor was hanging off the side, begging for his life. And then Gavin just let go. Um, Detective Booth, it's Detective First. Can we come in? Sure, what's this about? Do you know what Irina Kosakoff? She's a conniving, manipulative little grifter who put my son through hell. She's dead. What? Are you serious? She was murdered. I can price out some of those um, prefab shower stall units. They have a little... Prefab? Plastic? No, no, they're mostly uh, acrylic. What, like, acrylic is plastic, isn't it? Acrylic, they're nice. Yeah. They're High-end the... plastic, they're very... High-end. But we're, we're getting into a substantial rebuild now. I mean, just eyeballing it, just top of my head, I would have to knock out this whole wall just to make space, and we'd have to rework these pipes. Thanks, thanks for that, Warren. Uh, but just give me a price for the shower, the doorway, and the support bars. Start with that, okay? Or we could come up with another solution. Like what? Thank you, thank you for ending that load of crap. You know what this girl is? She's a hooker, my uncle turned out. She's a scabby, untrustworthy skank. She's gonna testify. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. This is a joke! No, we're not holding her for anything. What reason would she have to lie? Because she's a filthy, dirty whore. What did your uncle do to you? <laughs> it's unbelievable. Huh? Now, despite my feeling that it was unnecessary, the chain of command suggested the unit all undergo combat stress counseling with a shrink. Commander Marin singled out BFC Kilpatrick for further treatment. Why do you suppose she did that? Kilpatrick had stopped caring about anything but the mission, ma'am. Could be argued that he was well-trained. Well, contrary to popular opinion, Colonel, a well-trained Marine is not an unthinking automaton. I'm just asking questions, Captain. PFC Kilpatrick was a bright, dedicated young man when I met him. But something happened to him, ma'am. I swear to God it wasn't supposed to go this far. He, he told me he was gonna ask for a ransom and we'd split it. That's it. Nobody was supposed to get hurt. Didn't quite work out that way, did it? Hey, look, I'm telling you the truth, all right? The guy went crazy. How'd you tell me? He was following us around. The guy had a camera. I, I thought he was a paparazzi. Uh, he tipped me a couple hundred bucks. Uh, I gave him a couple places where we'd be, so, you know, we'd be able to get a good picture. Hey, so how did it evolve from there? He, he approached me a few days ago. I was waiting for Chelsea to come out of the hotel, and that's when he told me the truth. I know what you're saying. Will your basement be in your sanctuary? It's kind of what this garden is for me, you know? It's my place to get away. You know what I love about it? Plant tomatoes, you get tomatoes. You plant cucumbers, you get cucumbers. No surprises. You ever do something voluntarily, Jim? Involuntarily? Yeah, you know. You get mad, you punch a door. Even though you know it's gonna hurt real bad, and if you were thinking clearly, you probably wouldn't have done it in the first place. It's just kind of a involuntary reaction yeah I, I guess well I involuntarily slept with your wife 